my first impression of the school, you know, was in you know, the friendliness, the you know, the fact that everyone is so you know so happy to come up and shake your hand and say hi. My name's this and this. How are you? You know, are you new here? Our boarding is so much like a community. Like you really feel like a big family there. Anyone you can talk to, you know, at any time. I mean, your dorms, like here in Beda, is all mixed up from block three to six one, which is like so different. So, what happens is you guys bring stuff, we put it in a box, and then you open it at the end of block five. Oh my god! So you look back at what you were like in block three, and we put in photographs. Mm -hmm. Um, well, I don't know. Yeah. Nelly, what do you think you would put in a time capsule box? To come here instead of another school is pretty simple. It's open, it's passionate, you're, you get so many friends, you're not discarded, you're always treated as your own. I think it's really encouraged me in the respect that the teaching standard is really high. You know, the teachers not only not only do you have such a good relationship with them, but they, they will change their teaching methods to suit the class. One of the activities is bread making, and you can use your hands, and it's a good opportunity to see friends, meet new teachers, and then at the end of it, you get to eat it, which is the best bit. You know, I think that's one of the great things about BDELS, is that when you try new things, you know, you do find passions that you never thought you would ever have. Good, one touch and the shot, good. Go, shots on target. OK, good start. Um, anything you notice from what Finn was doing? I play hockey for my county, and BDAS really has helped me because it's not, it's not only that we have those lessons, you know, where they're coaching us, it's that you're able to play for a year above, two years above, like depending on your ability. OK, everyone, well, thanks for being at this meeting. We're going to be talking about the Harvard survey that you've all just participated in and that you helped construct. I guess what I'm interested in today is roughly what you said. I think having a student voice at this school is very nice because the teachers don't think of it, oh, it's a student's voice, but they think of it as, OK, they're saying something important, they're saying something that they want to get their point across. Uh, I tried to stress the importance of remembering that the ability to absorb loads of information being thrown at you in sort of a lecture-type form of teaching really comes with age. I said how I liked lessons to be split between sort of doing, say, science and practical. It's not just a school where you feel like you're sitting back and just watching it all coming. You feel like you're a really big part of it. I think the reason that most people enjoy this school is because of the ethos and people here really like to express themselves in ways that in other schools you weren't really allowed because the boundaries here are not stretched but more open in the way that you really want to be heard. It's not that like you just can be heard but you're also wanted. In English your voice becomes more passionate and in drama it becomes more intense and in, in any subject really you're just you want to speak and you want to tell the world what you're thinking and that's what's so great about this school is you really want to tell people what you are.